3D code, a product of the Ukrainian company Pilgwe, was released in 2007 as a digital sculpting and texturing software. It set itself apart with a focus on voxel sculpting, a unique approach at the time. Unlike many traditional polygonal sculpting tools, voxel-based modeling allows artists to work without worrying about geometry stretching or polygon limits. This makes it ideal for creating intricate details in character design and concept art where freeform creativity is paramount. Early versions of 3D code garnered attention for their intuitive approach to digital sculpting. Positioning the software as a user-friendly tool for both amateurs and professionals. The development of 3D code has been marked by constant updates that expand its two sets. As the software evolved, Pilgui introduced capabilities like UV unwrapping, bridge topology tools for simplifying complex models into usable low polygon meshes, and the robust texturing system that includes both hand painted and PBR workflows. The more recent versions, including 3D Code 2024, have made significant strides in performance and usability. This update brought features like live booleans, which enabled dynamic merging and subtraction of shapes, vector displacement brush support, and an improved Python API for scripting, allowing users to automate tasks and integrate custom tools. In its early years, 3D Code struggled to gain recognition against well-established software like ZBrush, which dominated the digital sculpting space. ZBrush's Dynamesh and Advanced Brush Engine made it the preferred choice for detailed sculpting work in the film and game industries. Although 3D Code offered unique features like voxel sculpting, the market inertia around ZBrush made it difficult for Pilgui to carve out a larger market share. Despite this, 3D Code found its niche amongst concept artists and indie game developers who valued its flexible sculpting and powerful texture painting tools. In particular, the software's auto-retopology feature was a game-changer, allowing artists to automatically generate a cleaner, animation-ready mesh for complex sculpt, saving time and effort. However, 3D Code faced another challenge with the rise of Blender, which began to rapidly expand its own sculpting, texturing, and modeling tools while remaining free and open source. 3D Code has encountered certain technical challenges over the years. A couple of them will be one performance issues. A significant challenge with 3D Code is its performance, especially when handling high-resolution textures and complex scenes. Users have reported that the 3D painting feature struggles with higher-resolution assets, particularly on mid-range GPUs. For instance, users with Radeon RX 6750 XT have noticed a considerable drop in performance when comparing newer versions like 2024.13 to previous versions such as 2023.1. This has made tasks like painting on 4K maps in 3D code feel slower and less responsive than a competitor like Substance Painter. Number 2 is going to be usability and interface issues. Despite its range of features, 3D code user interface has been critiqued for being unintuitive. New users often find it challenging to navigate the complex interface, which lack the streamlined workflow that some competitors offer. This can make the learning curve steep even for users familiar with other 3D softwares like ZBrush. Number 3 is Tool Stability Various tools in 3D code have faced stability issues across different updates. For example, the Pose and Curve tool have occasionally behaved unpredictably, causing difficulties during precise modeling tasks. Additionally, tools like the Freeze tool and some of the newer painting brushes have been reported to malfunction in certain scenarios, leading to frustration amongst artists. Number 4 is going to be integration with external render engines. Another technical limitation is 3D Code's compatibility with external rendering engines. Users have expressed a desire for better integration with industry standard rendering tools, which would make it a more versatile option for production pipelines. While it offers some rendering capabilities, the lack of seamless integration has pushed users to rely on other software for rendering, adding additional steps to their workflow. 3D Code is widely used in several industries including game development, film, VFX, virtual reality, and 3D printing. The software's strength lies in its versatility, 
it can handle both organic and hard surface modeling with ease making it suitable for character and environment creation. Its texture painting tools, which allows artists to paint directly onto models with high-resolution textures, have made it popular for creating realistic assets. The indie game development community has particularly embraced 3D code due to its ability to quickly iterate on designs and produce high-quality assets. It's been used in various independent projects and game studios to create detailed models and textures. Its role in larger, well-known projects is often not as visible due to the confidentiality of studio pipelines, but it is well known to complement softwares like ZBrush and Substance Painter in professional environments. Studios use it for retopology and UV unwrapping. Integrating it with pipelines that rely on multiple tools for different stages of asset creation. One of the most significant hurdles 3D code faces is the rise of Blender, a free and open source 3D software that has become a formidable presence in the 3D modeling space. Blender's development space backed by a large community and significant financial support from industry leaders like Epic Games and Nvidia has allowed it to close the gap with specialized tools like 3D Code. Blender sculpting tools enhanced through community-driven development now offers features comparable to 3D Code's voxel sculpting, reducing the need for separate software. Blender's Grease Pencil tool is another which allows for 2D animation within a 3D space and also geometry nodes for procedural modeling provide creative flexibility that many artists find appealing. Additionally, Blender's texture and shading capabilities have advanced rapidly, integrating features for real-time previewing through its EV engine and realistic rendering with cycles. The fact that Blender is completely free gives it a competitive edge over 3D Code, which comes with a commercial license. While 3D Code offers a specialized tool set that some professionals prefer for specific tasks like detailed texture painting and retopology, Blender's broader appeal and cost effectiveness have made it the go to solution for many small studios and freelancers. To counter this, 3D Coach has focused on improving interoperability with Blender through better uplink support, aiming to make it easier for artists to use both tools side by side. 3D Coach 2024 release marks a strategic effort by Pilgwe to enhance its position in the market. The update includes tools like AI Assistant, designed to streamline common tasks, and Scene Skill Master, aimed at improving better precision for game-ready models. These updates underscores Pilgwe's focus on usability and integration with the broader ecosystem of 3D software. The future of 3D code depends on its ability to maintain a balance between offering unique high-end features and adapting to the increasingly competitive 3D software market. By continuing to refine its sculpting and texturing tools while enhancing interoperability with other industry standard tools like Blender and Unity, 3D code has the potential to retain its niche market. However, the challenge remains significant as the lure from Blender's versatility, extensive online tutorials, and vibrant user community continues to attract new users away from paid software solution. 3D Coach remains a powerful tool for those who need specialized features like voxel sculpting and advanced texture painting. It has also carved out a loyal user base in niche market and continues to evolve with regular updates. However, it struggles to compete with Blender's no-cost ever-expanding feature set as an ongoing challenge. The key to 3D Coach's success lies in leveraging its strength while adapting to industry trends, focusing on ease of use and maintaining a clear value proposition amidst the shifting landscape of 3D modeling tools. Okay, if you love this video, kindly don't forget to subscribe, like, share. Until my next video, peace.